Now at 11, CBD, we're hearing more and more about it. It's a compound from the marijuana plant that's used to treat chronic pain and other illnesses as an alternative to opioids and other painkillers. However, it's still perceived with some skepticism. But tonight, a former Miami Dolphin player is coming forward claiming CBD is the key to pain relief. Here's CBS 4's Jim Barry with a story you'll see only on 4. That's very key stop here. Chester there. 14 years ago, Larry Chester was a bruising defensive lineman for the Miami Dolphins, a 300-pound strong man who knew how to hold his ground. It's fall. Good hold. And finally straightened by Brock Mary, and then the ball comes out with it. And then Larry Chester, he just has to fall on it. Today, Chester is a man searching for answers. He says seven seasons in the NFL left him in chronic pain. I was eating uh, opioids, if you will, in some search of relief and was not finding it. Even worse, Chester says, was his depression. For two years after retirement, the former defensive tackle says he became a belligerent shut-in. I'm lashing out on my children unnecessarily, lashing out on my wife. Chester says while still in the NFL, he would smoke marijuana for relief. Even then, he felt that it helped him settle down. I could have a uh, 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 a human exchange where we don't we don't agree and I don't want to throw you through the wall and I can just accept that. Remember I told you that one of the side effects of cannabis is that it helps your body utilize your insulin a little bit more. Now Chester has become a profound believer in CBD, one of the most common chemical compounds found in the marijuana plant. He takes it in various forms, which is prescribed by his Miami-based cannabis doctor. This is about as about real. As much as I use for rubbing into maybe even my knees that have issues, 15 minutes later my pain is gone. I literally left my job mm. at the hospital mm. to do this. Dr. Irve Damas played one season in the NFL. After career-ending knee injury, Damas went to medical school and became a traditional doctor before overcoming his own skepticism about untraditional cannabis treatment. Why does it work? The most important reason is that we actually produce these substances in our body. There are things that happen in our lifetime, maybe injury, illness, um, stress, things that cause a decreased production of your endocannabinoids. When that happens, you fall out of a state called homeostasis, which is your natural state of balance or well-being. Then you start bring yourself back to the level that you need to be at. And that's why it works. However, this emerging medicine is shrouded in plenty of doubt. Some doctors say cannabis has only been proven to be effective treating epilepsy and that there's no evidence that it helps with any mental or emotional disorders. Dr. Damas, who runs Grassroots Medicine and Wellness Center in Wynwood, disagrees. The U.S. government has one patent and cannabis is seen and known, scientifically proven to be a neuroprotective. That means players, people involved in collision sports. If you are able to consume cannabis, you are actually able to protect your brain with the cannabinoids, the substances within the plant. Chester and his doctor believe the NFL would be wise to sanction cannabis products as acceptable treatment for current players. I think you would see an increase in performance, a decrease in injuries. For the NFL, marijuana is still a banned substance, but in recent years it has partnered with its Players Association to study marijuana use for pain management. And the mood, mood experience. Way, way better. After visiting a few traditional treatment centers, Chester hails cannabis treatment as his salvation. And now his wife is a believer too. Thank you from the bottom of my heart for giving me my husband, my best friend, back to me. You feel like you're getting your life back? Absolutely. Marriage, my interaction with my children, interaction with my neighbors, um, communities. I feel more like me than I've felt in a long time, man. So Larry Chester offers quite a testimonial. Yeah. Now, some folks watching may wonder if I rub CBD oils all over my body, <laughs> will I get high? The answer is no, because no. it doesn't have the level of THC that you get in marijuana to give you that buzz. Who else could be a candidate for this treatment, Jim? Just about anybody who suffers from chronic pain, whether it's from inflammation, if you were a former athlete, or just uh, suffering from a serious illness. Uh, and it's interesting because Dr. Damas says it doesn't necessarily have to compete with traditional methods. It can be something to complement them. And also, as an interesting aside, it's now also considered a possible treatment option for folks with their pets.
Really? Yes. That'll be the next story. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Jim. All right.